Uh, Religious Affections was written by a man named Jonathan Edwards. He was a pastor in Northampton, Massachusetts, uh, in his town. Uh, they had had a couple revivals. Uh, in 1734 and 35, there was a revival in his town. Uh, he had preached on justification by faith alone. And there were about 300 converts, 300 people from his church that were uh, adults that were converted. They professed faith in Christ. Uh, that's about half the adults in the town. So it was, a, it was a pretty major outpouring of God's Spirit. In a pretty short period of time, many people were converted. Uh, fast forward uh, to 1741, 1740 or 1740 and 1741, uh, the Great Awakening is happening in that general area. Um, George Whitfield has been preaching in the area. He's preached at Edwards Church. And in that context, another outpouring, a, a greater outpouring of God's Spirit ha happens, and more people profess faith in Christ. And so in this context, um, Edwards is encouraged. He, he believes uh, that these revivals really are a work of God's Spirit. And yet one thing that he notices in the years after, um, in the months and years after, uh, especially that second uh, outpouring, which is the first Great Awakening, he noticed that many had, had fallen away. Many were not living up to the profession that they had made. And it bothered him. And he was trying to figure out what's the problem here because we have a profession of faith that doesn't match up to a changed life. And so how do we make sense of this? It appears that maybe some of those that professed faith are not truly converted. And so he began uh, to, to think about this as he was counseling people in his church, and he began to uh, write on the subject. And religious affections is really the uh, outgrowth of this, this thinking and then eventually the writing. He, he preached a series of sermons on it uh, in 1742 and 43, and then by 1746 he's, he's published this book. Mm -hmm.